Hello guys, I'm gonna try to do a quick explanation between the difference, um, sorry, the, about the difference between uh, parallel and series elastic components. So, um, I have this slide, which is the one from your notes, and remember we talked about um, having different arrangements, right? So. When we're talking about serious arrangements, we're talking about that is something that is in serious. Okay? When we're talking about something that is parallel, we're talking about an arrangement that is parallel with each other. Okay? When we look at a muscle, okay, generally we would expect to have muscle in the middle. And then we ha we would have tendon on either side, maybe just one side, but that's just the natural arrangement of how it is, okay? If we look in here, so parallel elastic component, okay? It refers to the muscle membranes, um, which is connective tissue. And it refers to the resistance to be stretched that they provide so they are it's connective tissue and you can think of connective tissue as having some sort of uh, being somewhat stiff so if you stretch and stretch and stretch it there's going to it's going to give you resistance to keep stretching it because otherwise it would break right so you wouldn't be able to do that very easily now we're talking about parallel because it is the connective tissue of the muscle membranes. And what are the muscle membranes? Let me find this other slide here. Okay, so here. So remember that the arrangement of each muscle, single muscle cell, so we have the muscle cell here, right? And the muscle cell, they go along the entire length of the muscle. So, meaning, that we will have many different muscle cells that are arranged parallel with each other. Therefore, and each of those, sorry, and each of those <clears throat> uh, single muscle fibers, they have this membrane around them, which is the connective tissue I am talking about, right? So where is this? So here. The idea is to understand that there is some resistance to stretch a muscle, you know, passively or whatever, stretched in general. So if I was going to pull on the two ends of that muscle, it's going to resist. And it's going to resist because of the connective tissue that is contained in the muscle membranes. And it's called parallel because muscle membranes and muscle cells are parallel with each other. Okay? Now, we are, when we are talking about <clears throat> the serious elastic component, now we are referring to tendons and the, the fact that tendons store elastic energy when they're tensed and they have the tendency to recoil, okay? So, um, let's separate this. So, these ones were the parallels and this one refers to the muscle membranes. I'm sorry, my sketches are terrible right now. Um, and this one is the parallel elastic component. The series, though, refers to the tendon. So we have tendon, then we have a muscle, and then we have another tendon, maybe. We have to have tendons because otherwise we wouldn't be able to attach them to muscle. I mean to bone, right? So then what's the arrangement of these, these guys? It's serious, right? So it's a serious elastic component. The major difference though, or one of the major differences is this one. So the PC, the parallel, resist 
this is stretch okay and it's passive right whereas the serious elastic component okay now we're talking about tendons and the thing about tendons is that they have the ability to wait, store elastic, oops, there we go, energy, okay? So this one has a tendency to recoil. recoil okay major difference so this one resist stretch with parallel because of the tissues that are involved so it's muscle membranes it just doesn't let you stretch a muscle because you know it's protecting it whereas the tendons you stretch them and they're like all right, they act like an elastic. They will store the elastic energy so that if you were going to contract right after, it will have a greater recoil, okay? But even if you didn't have an, a contraction, they it would still co recoil. So this is more, um, I guess you could say that it's a little bit more active, okay? I hope that helps.